Hi, I'm Peter Switzer and I really hope you're coping with the strange circumstances we all find ourselves in. One lady who I know pretty well said, it's like being caught in an episode of the twilight zone. I think she's absolutely right. No one expected a pandemic of global proportions, let alone the closure of businesses and the national lockdown of employees. And while this is all very, very stressful, try to use this time as a period where you actually personally recalibrate and get yourself ready for the time when we all go back to work again. And time is the critical issue to think about right now because the virus and the government have given you spare time at home that you never have believed was possible. So what can you do with that time? One of the most inspirational guys I ever worked with and interviewed is John Maxwell, who wrote the book, The 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership. He said a turning point in his life was when his mentor asked him, John, what is your plan for self-improvement? And like most of us, John said he didn't have one. Now, this is a book really worth reading while you have time on your side right now. And creating a plan for self-improvement and actioning it over the weeks ahead before normalcy returns would be a great use of your time. One of the big excuses we all have for not getting fit or losing weight or not reading life-changing books and so on is, I haven't got the time. Well, now you do, so I recommend you read about what government help is out there the website australia.gov.au is really useful for that. And I've done a lot of work with the CBA's website to help business owners find out about the assistance on offer. So check that one out as well. The one thing we Aussies are great at doing is coming back from impossible circumstances to take the prize. Who can forget Kieran Perkins winning the 1500 at the Atlanta Olympics when he was in the outside lane as an outsider with an outsider's chance of winning? And this is all about courage. You are seeing the best of the best. You are a superstar, Kieran Perkins. Save at the moment, Australia. And look at when Perkins in, about 15 metres to swim. This is rare gold. The best kind of goal. Perkins goes in first. What a great win. I recommend you use this difficult time to challenge yourself. Go looking online or in books to find improvements that will give you an enormous competitive edge when you get back to work. I've always loved the advice from Jim Rohn who told us, don't wish it was easier, wish you were better. If you're reading too much coronavirus news that's making you feel really negative, well stop. Go looking for people like me who will help you with your money goals or Tony Robbins and people like him who will help you with your self-belief, which is so important during times like these. And maybe Google your favourite sporting heroes or actors who've become world-class performers coming from nowhere but who did it because they really wanted it. To wrap up, I'd like to share with you my favourite quote. It comes from the great tennis player Chrissy Evert, who explained her extraordinary career in the following way. There were times when deep down I wanted to win so badly I could actually will it to happen. I think most of my career was based on desire. Make the coronavirus threat the time opportunity of your lifetime so you can become a much better you.